Hi, this is Brian with King Grizzly. Today we are going to look at shortcuts or hotkeys in the Elementor page builder. There's some really useful ones. Um, so we'll just mess around with this page and, and try them out. Um, one of the first ones is command question mark. And if you're on a PC, just substitute control. If I hit command question mark, whoops, got to be clicked in the window first we can see what they are. So that kind of, <laughs> if, if you know how to do that, you don't need the rest of this. Um, but I will show you uh, some of these just uh, to explain some of them. So um, as we look at some of them, they're pretty obvious, like undo, command Z is really useful, command shift Z. And what's nice is you can do multiple undos. We can look at that. We can copy and paste. We can even copy and paste the style from one element to another. Um, the delete button will work to delete elements. Uh, you can see there's a variety of options here. A really useful one is Finder, Command E. Um, let's take a look at that. So quit is escape. And that's actually what I'm going to press to get rid of that. So let's try Command E, Finder. So now what we can actually do is um, search for different things inside of Elementor, including other pages. So I could start typing. You can see We've got save templates. Um, I can edit a different page. I've got kind of a bunch of random stuff in this site. Um, I can add a new post, add a new page, add a new template. There's some different types of integrations and things we've got here. So just that command E is really useful for switching from page to page. Um, let's go ahead and make a few changes here. Like I don't like how this text is running into this other text. So I'm going to make a maybe like a a margin change. Yeah, there's a negative bottom margin. I don't know why, but this will go ahead and let us look at some things. So I can right click this and hit copy, but I could also go ahead and hit Command C or Control C, and then I can go click on the next one and hit Command Shift V, and that's going to paste the style. A right click and paste style will get the job done too. Um, so I could go through these and make that happen style. Um, if I want to pull up my history, Command Shift H will on the left pull up the history. Maybe I want to go back in time. Um, I didn't like that change. Um, or alternatively, I can do Command Z over and over or Command Shift Z to redo. So those are some of the best uh, sort of quick shortcuts. There's even Command P for preview that just hides this left pane here. Um, so for real power users, you're going to want to hit that you know, command question mark and get the hang of some of these. But the ones I find myself using the most um, are typically, um, oh, Navigator. I didn't mention Command Shift I. I was going to say, well, Navigator is the thing I use the most. But Navigator, um, Finder are ones I use quite a bit and then just kind of undo and redo. Other stuff I tend to take care of with right clicking. Um, but Navigator Command Shift I. We have a tutorial on how to use Navigator. Definitely check that out uh, if you're not familiar with it. It's a really powerful tool. So hopefully that helps give us some of the basics of the hotkeys in Elementor. And I would encourage you to subscribe to this channel uh, if you're interested in more Elementor learning content. We will be rolling out some pretty ambitious resources um, over the coming weeks and months. And uh, stay tuned. Thanks.